so you will probably be able to relate to this. When I wanted to become more masculine on self-improvement, I just saw a bunch of uh, useless advice on YouTube that is just being repeated again and again and again, and that it was just to become stronger, to uh, become financially independent and stuff like that. Some stuff that everyone knows pretty much. Obviously, you need to be strong. Obviously, you need to be able to provide and stuff like that. But uh, I had a big dilemma, which was... Uh, if I was in a situation where someone disrespected me hard or something like that, is masculinity there uh, to be obnoxious, loud, fight back, or to be stoic, unfazed, not care, uh, literally like what would a stoic philosopher do in that situation? So what is real masculinity here? Would it be to literally like get into the fight and uh, beat someone up or uh, to be stoic and not do anything, not react to it? And I was always thinking, like, what is the real masculinity here? And then uh, I saw two personas of one being the how some people view masculinity and the other one being the real masculinity. And this is Conor McGregor and uh, Khabib Nurmagomedov. And here is the difference. So uh, Conor is a guy uh, who has this kind of... Uh, he has high testosterone, probably. He's probably... He has used some drugs in the past or already like some kinds of steroids and um, he has some of these masculine traits that people will consider to be masculine like he's strong obviously he fights uh, he is he's able to provide because he's rich he drinks whiskey and stuff uh, he can have a lot of women and stuff like that he's uh, he's ob always like loud obnoxious he's like literally full of testosterone and that can be viewed as uh, real masculinity but if you look at um, the other guy, Habib, in this situation, uh, Habib is literally like uh, the, in some ways, the opposite of Connor, but uh, he is the real masculinity. And let me explain this. So, uh, if you look at his values, which are to be strong, uh, to be religious, uh, to have a family, to provide, uh, to be stoic, uh, and to care about your values not to let anyone attack your values and insult your values. Uh, if you look at these things and just being a morally good person, he is the real masculine person here. And if you want to become more masculine, you only need to copy the stuff that he did, that he does. And these are becoming stronger, knowing how to fight, uh, having a family in the future, uh, being religious, believing in God, uh, just uh, being a morally good person, never doing wrong, never cheating, uh, never using drugs and stuff, um, not drinking, uh, not partying and doing bullshit. So you just want to be like Habib in pretty much every sense. You just don't obviously need to go to the UFC, but everything else that he did is so, so masculine. Like he is the perfect, he is the pinnacle of masculinity, if you ask me. So if you want to become more masculine, you just need to Maybe watch some of his talks. He released a podcast recently with uh, PBD. So the podcast was pretty good. And you can see how masculine he is. The, his frame, his values, and how uh, how he's stoic. He's unfazed, pretty much. So you just want to be more like him if you want to be more masculine. And that's pretty much it. That's the, that's the real response. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. See you tomorrow.